to it, yeah Pop out with a truck, huh, get into it, yeah If you go to church, I should get into it, yeah Like if she ain't got a butt, I fuck it, get into it, yeah And I say, I just got a ball, get into it, yeah Pop out with a truck, get into it, yeah If you go to church, get into it, yeah If she ain't got a butt, fuck it, get into it, yeah Yeah, you just wanna party, you just wanna lap dance You just wanna pop up on these cans like you the Batman Month of August, again, a massive, massive month again. So we've hit over, I think, 12 sales or something just for this month alone, which has been fantastic. Really, really good listings, um, which have come to the market, if not are coming to the market as well. So based off that, we've had a massive start since January. I can't really say start because it's almost the end of the year already. It's that crazy, but uh, well over 73 sales. Uh, at the moment, 65 listings. Um, I think it's 57 million, I think, of properties that we sold since January. So another massive amount of numbers before. Again, this has been a record for my career so far. Um, but yeah, now I've got a phone call, so. Alrighty, 21 Pixley Street, Watermark Residences on the western side of Kangaroo Point, direct riverfront. This is one of my favourite buildings in Kangaroo Point, built in 1998 um, as well. We've got the two different towers, we've got 11 apartments in one, 19 in the other. Um, over the last couple of years we've sold a penthouse, a sub penthouse, one of the ground floor units, a few other units in between the rest as well and a lot of people are sinking a lot of money in here to improve a lot of the values which is great. But 605 is where we're going through now. Um, this one here was interesting. We had this off market, sorry, we had this on the market end of last year, subject to the sale of another property. Um, unfortunately, that fell through just under $2 million. And good news, we've now officially sold the property for $2 million and eighty off market. And shout out to obviously the boys from Cohen Handler. So Jordan and Brandon, um, dealing with their client who came through here a couple of times. We've managed to get the deal together, so let's go check it out. Good luck trying to film this. Where am I actually standing? So this is what sells a place. So this is over 220 square meters. So it is three slash four bedrooms. So on the right is a fourth bedroom. Um, you can just reinstate the wall. I think these guys are gonna open it up into a bigger living space as well. Um, pretty amazing renovations some people have done here in the building. Some people have opened the kitchens up all the way up. So it looks amazing, but come out here because this is what absolutely sells it. Direct riverfront. Now, an interesting story about this building here is because of the width of the frontage, we've got 25 meters frontage here across the penthouse and the sub penthouse we sold a couple of years ago, um, which in penthouse we've now just resold for four and a half million as well. Um, for example, those clients were actually contracted in to, to Scott Street, um, which we sell for about four and a half with Simon. And for example, two people have come over here because the frontages are a lot bigger. Again, you've got pretty amazing views out to the city, the gardens, and obviously to the, I guess, the cliffs as well. But another big selling factor here is you've got the pedestrian bridge. So if you're not familiar with the pedestrian bridge, over that side where the marina berths are, there's a bridge directly running across the Green Bridge in Kangaroo Point, um, which you'll be able to walk downstairs, go directly straight across into the city. Then you've got the Queen's Wharf on the left-hand side, which is a $3.6 billion infrastructure. So. Really, really amazing apartment. Uh, these guys did very well. So um, shout out to the guys again from Cohen Handler and congrats again to our good clients, um, Lynn and Richie, for the sale of this property as well. Oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. But anyway, while you've got me here, I actually don't know if there's like a bird thing or a plant thing, but anyway, regardless of what it is, while we're here, we're in 101 at 193 Main Street in the heart of Kangaroo Point in the peninsula. We've got this massive courtyard apartment here. Um, this was a really interesting story. This was a well, well run campaign for this one. Uh, a couple of other agents we're up against were saying it's worth in the early 500s. Again, us knowing a lot of the knowledge around the area and the stock that we sell and I guess the audience that we try to bring through had a really good result. The owners were after around roughly mid fives for this. Um, ran a really good campaign. In two weeks, we met over 43 people just through the open homes and private inspections as well. Make sure we got all the property staged correctly, launched the campaign online quite aggressively as well. Um, from that result, we had 84 inquiries online, 47,000 views online, and we ended up selling it in the first week 
for over, I guess we got $615,000, which is an amazing result here for the building. Again, one of the highest sale prices for this particular type of unit in the peninsula part. Again, so again, really, really good result. With that amount of offers, we still got a lot of buyers. So if you have something similar in the area, please let us know. Also, based off the back of this, we have actually got another property under contract around the mid 600s um, in the peninsula part as well. So we will get that to get the, the mm, Good chat, we'll get back to that eventually. But anyway, really good result. So again, thank you to the owners for entrusting us in this one and patience, because again, presentation is everything. Getting the staging right, getting the photography done correctly, getting the video done, doing an aggressive launch, getting as many people through as we can, well over 40 groups through and eight offers. So really, really good result. That's what we like to see. So clients sharing on social media, one of our gifts. So if you sell a property or purchase a property through us, um, I've got a pretty good campaign afterwards, so we do look after you clients, because if it wasn't for you guys, then we wouldn't be in business. Um, but now you're part of the Bacon Team um, Lifetime Program, where you get gifts for your birthday, you get an update of valuation each year on your property, um, so you can see where it's sitting on, and plus much more benefits as well. Um, so shout out to Grace and Liam, congrats again, settling your first property, um, you're moving in today, I believe, and over the weekend. Um, so that's a unit, uh, unit in Ballard in Norman Park which we'll probably go check out maybe later. Anyway, just drove past Deacon Street. So it's all a part of that peninsula part. Just got 114 away, which is a one bedroom there uh, for just over mid 200s. Um, so it's a really good investment actually. But um, yeah, congrats. That should be, I think that's settling next week, I believe. But really good investment property there. Right in the heart of the peninsula. So another one away in the peninsula part. Now we're going outside the peninsula towards Wollongabba section uh, called the Duke Apartments. Cool rooftop. That's it, thanks for watching guys. <laughs> All right, on the top of the rooftop of the Duke, so 18 Duke Street in Kangaroo Point, right on the edge of Wollongabba. So where the Gabba is directly behind me, that is the start of Wollongabba. Go figure. Um, if it was me that lived here, I'd probably charge people to come up and actually watch a game because it's actually a pretty epic view of when they have performances again, whenever that would be, who knows. But uh, this is a really good scenario as well. This is on the market, so unit 1203 with another agent last year, getting offers around the 350 mark. Definitely weren't happy with them. Uh, we managed to get under contract trot. trot. Good chat, Michael. Anyway, managed to get under contract twice. Uh, first time, unfortunately, fell over because of the finance. Second time, got under contract within 48 hours straight after it uh, to a cash purchaser down south. So an investor gradually going to move up eventually when they get a chance to for just under $400,000. Alrighty, 44 Mile Street. So this is actually one of my good developers I know pretty well. Our good clients who own Melbourne Avenue, which we're about to go to next, so they're on the market. Um, ended up purchasing the penthouse here, just under between a million and one and a half million. So been looking for them for a while, so it's a pretty amazing um, project that they've done here. But um, looking forward to getting through you this one soon. Okay, that's it, done. <laughs> done. Dylan, done. Done, Dylan, done. Goodbye. Hi, Michael. Hey, Mark, how are you going? Not too bad. That's good. Just giving you a call to say, obviously, congratulations. It's all unconditional. Oh, look, you know, Michael, beyond all the pressures of commercial life, Mama, you know, when, when you as a match, and that's what you are, you're a matchmaker of property. Yeah. Every now and then when you match the right person for a property, a good property, you've, you've done something beyond just making money, as you well know. Yeah, yep. No, 100%. So it's, um, yeah, good news for everyone, absolutely. Well, congratulations again, and um, yeah, looking forward to chatting soon, hey? Yeah, will do. Thank Beautiful. you. Thanks, mate. Okay, th Chat th soon. Thanks, Bye. Bye. There we go, very happy owner. 14 Melbourne Avenue in Camp Hill. You've definitely seen this one across social media. We've had a massive start to the campaign. Next Sunday's the auction, so looking forward to selling this one under the hammer. Um, this one here is a five bedroom, three, sorry, two bathroom, two car accommodation, 405 block. 
going under the hammer next Sunday. Again, well done to Chris. His first listing, cracker of a listing as well. Also his first auction. Um, so that's really good campaign for him that he started to run. We've had over 75 groups from the first two weeks. Got another open home tonight, one on the weekend and one next week. So let's see if we can get over 100 people through the property in total. Looking forward to the result for these amazing clients of ours. All right, you're probably familiar with where we are. We're actually in New Zealand um, called Ballard. Anyway, it's been a long day. We're actually in Ballard at Norman Park in Norman Avenue. I uh, can't even talk. Okay, 208 Norman Park, Norman Avenue, Ballard Residences. Um, we've been here plenty of times, again, selling the project. Um, we've got two more away, so 207. So congrats to Liam and Grace. They just moved in today and settled. So congratulations. Very exciting to purchase your first property um, and also an investor from down south that's also settled a couple of days ago uh, for 112. Um, we've only got two properties left. Sorry, one property left now in here. We did have a, only a couple left. A few fell over, unfortunately, due to finance, but we've managed to get a lot of them back under contract again. So looking forward to getting this sold out. It's been a long process since December, trying to sell this property, sorry, this whole project out um, of 35 apartments, sorry, 39 apartments. I can't even talk, it's that late in the afternoon. I've been working too late. It's time to just go to bed, see you guys, thanks. Alrighty, to end the month of August, again, we've had a massive month. I think we've done over about 12 sales, uh, well over five listings as well. So a massive turnout since the start of the year, but most importantly, well done to my team, Chris and Elise. So we had the quarterly, not the quarterly, sorry, the annual awards last week, and we managed to come away with a black award, uh, which again is a big achievement for myself. I'm very proud of the team. So the, first, the youngest person to ever be in the black club, uh, which is a big achievement in the place group. The top 20 ended up being 19th and 10 an individual in the group. So massive achievement. Looking forward to seeing the next 12 months. Um, I don't know if you can hear any of this because of the road, but anyway, well done, we're leaving, goodbye.